Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing this wash and go. I'm kind of excited about it. I love how it turned out. I love how big my hair is. It is a little bit shrunken. I did stretch it, but it's a little humid, so it's going to start shrinking up even more. So um, I really like how this wash and go turned out. It wasn't the original plan of how I wanted my wash and go to go for this week, but I still like it um, and I will talk about that throughout the video as well um, I did use some products from the curls line I use the blueberry bliss line I believe it's called I have used their twist and shout cream and a lot of their other products off camera before I don't think I've ever used them on camera but for this specific video I did use the blueberry bliss. I think it's the cold curl control jelly to do this wash and go along with my mango butter as well so if you guys are interested in seeing how i got this beautiful voluminous defined slash undefined wash and go um and then definitely stay tuned but before we hop into the video um if you are new here please consider subscribing if you end up liking this video and turn your notifications on so you do not miss an upload i do currently upload every monday wednesday and friday between two and five just so you guys know if you don't get an alert just check back on the on those days i've probably uploaded a video and if you are an old subscriber of mine just double check and make sure your notifications are turned on as well by hitting the little bell and you will be alerted every time I upload a video and yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you guys next time bye guys Okay, so let's hop into this video, guys. So I'm gonna be starting off with freshly washed and deep conditioned hair. Um, I do have my leave-in conditioner applied, which I do apply my leave-in conditioner in the shower now. Um, I've actually been doing that probably for over a year now. But I did use the leave-in from this line, the Blueberry Bliss leave-in um, conditioner. It made my hair real, really, really soft. Um, I do go in and kind of re-wet my hair with some aloe vera juice. And then I'm going to go in with a tiny, tiny bit of my mango butter to apply that to give it just a little bit of added moisture, some shine, seal it in. This stuff works really, really good. You can find it on my website, shoptotaldivaray.com. If you guys are interested, I will have the link down in the description box as well. Next, I'm going to go in and just brush my hair through. My hair is pretty detangled, so I didn't really brush it through that much. And then I'm going to go in with the Curl Control Jelly by Curls. And I'm just going to be applying that all over my hair. Originally, I don't know, I had, I thought this was going to be like a thicker gel so I thought it was going to kind of give me more of like that wet line or main choice type of feel and I felt like it was just a really light gel not a bad thing but for what I planned on doing or what I planned on my hair looking like it just didn't so that's why you don't see me shingling my hair because I just felt like it just wasn't going to work with this hairstyle so I just raked it through smoothed it through just so my curls curls can clump together and I just pretty much repeat those steps all over my head until I am finished while I'm doing this um, my dip my hair does feel really really nice I love the smell of the products it just smells super like super sweet but just nice and light I just love how it smells so as far as I'm concerned as far as the smell I do like it the line itself I do like it I'm gonna be honest it's not like my favorite line um, as far as the whole line as as a whole as far as the actual products um, I do like the twist and shout cream but it's still not it's like not in my top five I'm gonna be honest because it doesn't give me as much moisture as I have with other products. I feel like the reason why my hair was personally so soft in this particular video is because of my mango butter um, that I included that. Not that the, my hair felt dry after this, but I feel like even after when I took the wash the deep conditioner out, it was soft, but it wasn't like exceptionally soft you know what I mean even with the leave-in conditioner I will say the leave-in conditioner is bomb like the leave-in conditioner is really really bomb out of everything that I used specifically today 
the leave-in conditioner is actually really, really good. So I just wanted to kind of talk through that while I was styling the rest of my hair. Um, but I'm just going to show you guys a section in the front, and then I will be back with the final results. Okay, so now that all the product is applied, I'm just going to go in and smooth my edges down by using the Blueberry Bliss Curl Control uh, Paste. Um, I do like this stuff. It's actually really nice. It doesn't leave your hair very sticky or hard. It just kind of really smooths it down and leaves like a soft hold. It's not like, you know, a really stiff edge control you know edge gel or anything like that it just really smooths the hair back and it's really really soft so i did like this stuff this actually was really really good and it was not greasy at all once i took it off and then i just tie my edges down and sit under my hooded dryer until my hair is completely dry it did not take my hair that long to dry i want to say i sat under the hooded dryer for about 45 minutes to an hour which is not bad at all for the you know the thickness ish of my hair so that was nice I didn't have to sit under the dryer really really long so this is after I have stretched my hair I went in with the hair growth oil from blueberry bliss curls line as well and i actually use this just to kind of like smooth through my hair to give a little extra shine you know just kind of give like that finishing touch i do rub it on my scalp whatever is left um i do like this oil again nothing special about it but it's really really nice and then this is the completed look i love actually how my hair turned out it was super big, super voluminous, super soft, just a really, really good wash and go. It was very effortless, not exactly the look that I was going for, but it's still a very pretty wash and go. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.